Hello everybody, I just wanted to come on here and show what I do in my house for backup power. So I actually have a generator interlock kit set up on my panel. And basically, uh, long and short of it, it keeps it from, uh, keeps you from being able to turn on the generator circuit. This is completely locked out while the main is on. So right here, until I turn off the main and slide over the entire framework here, it will not let the generator circuit kick in. So that's the safety net and to meet the electrical code. It has a little instructions on here on what to do. I had an electrician come in, get everything wired up for the generator circuit. This is wired up and goes to an inlet box that's on the outside of my house so that when the circuit is turned on, the generator is hooked up. Of course, the main is off, so you can't backfeed into the grid. You can actually backfeed the panel and run a lot of the things in the home during that outage off of the generator power. And I've got a pretty big generator that I have for outside. Uh, 10,000 starting watts, uh, 8,000 running watts. So I just wanted to display what this interlock kit does. Again, I cannot slide this framework over, and this is actually really tight as well, um, while the main is on. If I shut off the main, and if I can turn on my flashlight, Now the main is off, everything's open here, and like I said, it's really tight. I actually want to go in and loosen it up a little. So now I've been able to slide this over, like I said, it was really tight, so I did it off camera. Uh, on my side, I need to loosen it up just a little bit, but it, it's all operational, it's just it's two-handed right now. Uh, but now that this is switched over, now I can flip on my generator circuit, my main is locked out. It does not let me turn the main back on. Everything's locked out. So now I can go outside and plug in the generator to the inlet box, fire up the generator, and power my house. So let's go do that. All right, so here is my generator. I just pulled it out of the garage. The DeWalt DX GNR 8000. Got the plug for the house. Have your standard plugs. It's got a runtime meter, shows you what the current wattage is in percentage. It has an idle control here that'll actually kind of uh, throttle it down a little bit when there's not uh, power demand on it. And it's electric start. So we've got the on off button and then when you press it up, it actually has the electric start on it. I've got a nice big cord here to run it out to the house so you don't have to have it anywhere near the house. And this is one of the models that does have uh, the carbon monoxide shut down as well. So let's go ahead, let's drag this into the backyard and get it fired up. All right, so now we're out in the backyard. I've got the generator set up. I always point it as far away from the house as I can with the exhaust uh, pointing away from the house, of course, for safety, all that fun stuff. And we've got a nice big cord here so I can run it from the generator to the house. And right here is my inlet box <clears throat> on the outside of the house. Uh, so underneath there, the cord has a uh, twist lock, runs into there, and that's where it runs into the house to provide power to the main circuits. So again, there's my inlet box out to my generator. All right, so we got her all hooked up. Got to run into the house. Super cold outside. We got the uh, fuel set to on. Go ahead. I'm going to change this. Turn the choke on. Come over here. And use our electric start. Here we go. It's not quiet, but we're making power. All right, so now I'm ready to go ahead and get the uh, main turn back on. I don't have it quite, there we go. We got it all the way over, so now the generator is locked out. And now I can flip 
my main breaker on. So that's kind of the overall operation. A little uh, safety net again, so that you cannot have both the generator circuit and the main connected. Uh, let's me come in here and make my choices on what I want to run. Just wanted to point out everything that I've got here. I've got it back on uh, utility power. We've got the generator shut off outside. And again, that generator circuit is locked out.